Today, Tesla released a huge update where it detects traffic lights and stop signs and stops for them. So it's a pretty incredible update. We're gonna go test it out. Come on, let's go. Okay, we got the latest software update from Tesla. It's version number 220 or 2020.12-11866. And this update gives us the ability to have uh, traffic light and stop sign control in beta. When you turn this on, the car is supposed to be able to stop at uh, red lights and stop signs. So we're gonna test that out. Let's go check it out. All right, so the car is driving itself. As you can see, my hands are not on it. My uh, feet are not on the brakes. And you can see over here that uh, it's keeping it center lane uh, or center of the lane. And we're coming up to a stop sign uh, down the road. So let's see if it can, oh, it sh shows us over here, stopping for traffic control in 400 feet. So this is pretty incredible. And it is absolutely stopping on its own. This is the next level of autopilot. This is absolutely phenomenal. So once it stops, it does ask you to use the accelerator to resume the control. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take it off the uh, autopilot, make a left and test it out on some uh, traffic lights as well. So let's go check that out. So once again, we have it uh, in autopilot going down. We're coming up against a red light here. Let's see if it can detect that. I have a feeling we're gonna actually hit it when it's green, so <laughs> yeah, that's not gonna work. Oh, notice, stopping for traffic, it came on, but uh, but it's green, so it's interesting. Why is it... Uh... So it, it was actually stopping for the uh, for the traffic light, even when it was green, so that, that was kind of an interesting, unexpected behavior. So we're gonna keep going until we hit another red light. Can you can you get this? Stopping for traffic. Notice um, there's a message here, stopping for traffic, and it's stopping on its own for the red light. Light turned green, it doesn't resume until you hit the accelerator. But once you hit the accelerator, it actually resumes uh, autopilot. This is pretty incredible. <laughs> wow. I am absolutely impressed. So we're about to approach another red light down the street. It's on autopilot. You can see it's uh, steering and driving on its own. And soon it should give us a little message in here, right there, stopping for traffic in just a little bit in 400 feet uh, due to the red light. So this is, uh, again, pretty incredible that it is able to detect this with a hard red line over here stopped at traffic control so notice um, it's still of course that uh, the lights are red but when the lights turn green it doesn't resume unless you tap the accelerator but once you tap the accelerator it does resume exactly where it left off so we're about to hit another traffic light here um, this one is green right now and we'll see what the car does. Now it's saying that uh, it's gonna stop for any traffic light unless you tap the accelerator. So it wants you to acknowledge uh, that you saw the traffic light is green by tapping the accelerator. Otherwise it does actually stop on green lights as well, which was not behavior that I would have expected, but I could see why they're doing that because they want you to be paying attention at every potential light. Uh, while the uh, neural nets are getting trained. So this is pretty fascinating. It's a great way to do it. He's into it. So I'm absolutely blown away by the, um, the smoothness of how well it actually reacts to red lights and stop signs. One thing I wasn't expecting is for it to actually stop on green lights. So here's a green light and the car is actually starting to stop. Uh, hitting the accelerator does resume uh, but that is kind of an unexpected behavior. I suspect it's part of the training mechanism that they have uh, going on. So this puts Tesla another huge step closer to complete full self-driving. Uh, the only thing left now is uh, turns uh, and uh, based on sort of uh, the destination in your nav system that you put in uh, and and then it's done, uh, right? I mean, it's 
it's pretty incredible. This is mind-blowing stuff. Wow, that was incredible. This definitely puts Tesla way above and beyond every other competitor. And I have to say, this puts them a huge step closer to full self-driving, something that Elon Musk has been promising for a long time. So it's coming. Till next time.